I've lived in Iran after the Islamic Revolution for 18 years. And as a teacher and a writer, I can still feel the sense of excitement I had um, every time I obtained um, a new issue of Iran Name. We lived in Iran, but um, because of the uh, political uh, situation over there and the censorship, um, um, there was very little spaces where we could have free conversations uh, about um, uh, Iranian history, its present reality, and our aspirations for its futures. Uh, there were very little spaces where we could have free flow and exchange of ideas about what it meant uh, to be an Iranian and, and, and what it meant to be connected to the world and all of this um, uh, Iraname brought to us. Uh, and uh, the amazing thing about it is that um, now uh, I have migrated to US and I've been living here for the past decade and a half and I still feel the same kind of excitement whenever a new issue of Iran Name comes um, into my hands. Uh, it connects me to Iran and it connects me uh, to scholars from all over the world. One of the most amazing things about Iran Name is um, the way it pays attention to the quality of scholarship rather than um, political ideologies. Uh, just look at the amazing array of its editors uh, from Jalal Matini to Dariush Shayegan, Dariush Shuri, uh, the amazing Hormoz Hekmat, and now um, its new um, intellectually vigorous and amazing Mohammed uh, Tabakole Targhi. They come from very different backgrounds and uh, um, socially, politically, culturally, their ideas are very different. But one thing they have in common is passion for knowledge and passion for Iran, and that is what makes Iran Name uh, so important. Um, uh, to um, every Iranian and not just the Iranian scholars.